what life is like in the BSAP. Come a guy, I, I, come a guy, come a rookie, come a guy. Come a guy, 
Everyone's in touch through the radio room to keep us up the peace. Electronics are a boom, come a guy, yay, 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 come a guy, come a rooty, come a guy. We have all this way out here, sending messages to those who need to hear, come a guy, yay, 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 come a guy, come a rooty, come a guy. Kind of call free to all stations plus Bravo Charlie Delta Rhodesia. Radio 1549 oblique 74. Dated 5, oblique 8, oblique 7, 4. Whiskey, oblique Alpha, issued this date for Paul Bond. Papa, Alpha, Uniform, Lima. Bravo, Oscar, November, Delta. Aged 24, height 178 centimeters. Medium build, dark curly hair. Tattoo of Python and Naked Lady on right forearm. Lima Sierra Whiskey Denim Jacket. Light colored Sierra Oblique Sierra Shirt and Denim Trousers. Believed in possession of Fiat Sedan, cream in color. Registration number 142845 Quebec.
there's nothing escapes detection. Come a guy, yeah, come a guy, come a guy, come a guy.
life is tough and you act on your own, there's a job to be done in the danger zone. September 1890, the site for the city of Salisbury was selected by Lieutenant Colonel Pennyfather, officer commanding the British South Africa Company's police. And 70 years later, on the 12th of September 1960, the force's long and close association with Salisbury was honoured by the presentation of the freedom of the city. Thousands watched the glittering spectacle of the occasion as the mayor of Salisbury, Councillor de Varis, called upon the town clerk to read the title deed. Commissioner of Police, Mr. B.G. Sperling, received the engraved scroll which was then carried in a ceremonial march past with fixed bayonets and colours flying. A fitting conclusion to the acceptance of the honour bestowed by the city on its friends and guardians, the British South Africa Police. of a police force, the year 1890. Today,
Peacekeeping is a vital world problem. We are proud of our achievements in Rhodesia. <laughs>